All right, so this is my new Retina MacBook Pro. Um, one of the things that I actually didn't know before I purchased it, and I, it's totally on me, I mean, they were upfront about this, is that um, it doesn't come with gigabit ethernet. Uh, call me old fashioned, but uh, I upgraded from a 2007 white book. I guess I was just stuck in the past expecting ethernet connectivity. Well, the problem with um, uh, just the normal Wi-Fi, even, you know, the super advanced however many uh, megabit it may be up to, is it still not up to gigabit speed. So, um, luckily, it has USB 3.0 and, um, and Thunderbolt, uh, which are both more than capable of supporting a, a network interface card for gigabit ethernet. Uh, so I went ahead and bought one. This one, uh, I got this, it's the, uh, whoop, the Anchor USB 3 gigabit ethernet controller. It was about, uh, it was less than 30 bucks, and that was including shipping on Amazon, so that's pretty good. Here's what it looks like here. Um, so not too uh, bulky or anything. Uh, so it's pretty impressive. Uh, so I wanted to just run some benchmarks on it, see uh, see how fast it goes. Well, immediately after plugging it in, um, it is detected. So, um, oh, one thing I should mention, you do have to install drivers for this. So um, it does come uh, in a box, a uh, little miniature CD, which should be compatible with uh, nobody's computer nowadays. I think it's how uh, all new Macs uh, ship without uh, DVD drive. So no, it looks like we're online. So I'm going to first run a benchmark of the hard drive itself that's in here. It's the PCI Express hard drive. That's uh, you know about you know greater than 600 megs uh, both ways. So that's on the uh, the local drive itself. So up here I have my, oops, my Mac Pro. The Mac Pro is connected to the MacBook. Um, so we're just going to run some benchmarks. This is so this may not be the fastest way to do it or the best way to do it, um, but I thought it was pretty impressive. So I'll go ahead and start it. It's about 109 megabytes per second. And about 100. So about 100 up and down. Um, so that's pretty good. I guess I have no complaints there. I mean, it's hot pluggable. I just plugged it in. Um, and once you, uh, that is once you get the drivers in and everything, um, and it just starts working. So that's pretty good speed. Um, not quite as good as um, what Gigabit is capable of, uh, but much faster than uh, any Wi-Fi out there. So 